I don't know what you call this, but I feel like this would have been a kind of bar. It's almost like a lounge, you just relaxed. I could picture people sitting around there and having a nice time looking through this window to see what might be happening. I don't know if there is a playground or but this seems to be like another floor on top of it. And just marvels me. I just go inside of here right now and I just have to pull up my camera. I was planning a better vlog to come and do but it is just what it is. Yes, let's get down. So, I'm inside of an abandoned hotel. Gateway hotel to be precise. It used to be a government hotel, but not anymore. So, I don't know what year it was. It was like a governor that was a ruling governor of Ogun State. He kind of sued this property out. And since then, there have been like court cases going on with the government and like the Chinese people. It's just crazy to see. Bro, I cannot imagine this place. So I cannot imagine this place. How it could be like when the when it's still they open. I look imagine say people just do this kind of place. Someone is here. This place there's light. Yes. Like this is very huge, and it's huge that side too. And it's raining. Today is Sunday. Just check out this massive. I don't know what to call this place. Maybe an hallway or whatever it is. But just check out the jungle beside it first. It's raining right now. So it looks like a mess. Man, I remember, I remember, and I remember, I remember it was a Christmas, 2005 Christmas. Yeah, this was where we spent our Christmas. Like it's my family, my dad, mom, drove all of us here, my brothers and sisters, to this place, to this gateway hotel. It was like an amusement park, fun park, that kind of thing happening. Like seeing that kind of stuff, Coming this kind of thing now. So breathtaking. Look at they were like art all over the old places. Nice piece of art. This is going to be a very short a very short video. Man, this is more about this place now but okay. Look at some of this building is collapsing. Part of it are breaking up. They say it's expiring or something. So I've got to be careful too when I'm walking here. But it's just amazing. Very, very amazing to see. There's a gravity up there. Let's go and check. What kind of graffiti is this? I think it's like a... This one is, is depositing like a... A god or something. Yes, this looks like a sacrificial stuff. And there's another nice guy. Fun to see. Maybe or maybe not. I don't know. This is just breathtaking. It's taking away my everything I plan to do. It's taking away it. My, let's see. Look at. See, this building is very wide. Maybe there's somewhere I can get to that place. I don't know. You see? Rain, rain, go away. Come again another day. Little children want to play. Rain, rain, go away. Come again another day. Little children want to play. Rain, rain. I've got a lot of questions because I'm very clueless and I need answers. I don't know what this is. I just need to know somehow. 
do to go check some place out let's go and see and just look at this just look at but vamos let's go see that place out man I can't believe I think I'm lost just so you know this hotel is like situated beside the express road bro just right direct at the express and there's a mox here looks very functional looks very neat and stuff i'm trying to go check out the hotel rooms and see what it is like right now at the moment bro i can see like chandeliers from outside of here no jokes let's go check out how this place looks like i'm very excited but i'm still not i might still get kicked out or something maybe i should follow you i don't know but let's go we'll see we we'll see how it's going how it goes and it's almost midday already but because of the weather the sun is not that out and stuff like that just check out this place check out this place i don't know how many rooms are inside of this place huh? i'm excited somehow let's go see what happens inside of here this is my excited face how it looks i've been told a lot of stuff so but for real i don't know what to expect i think some activities actually going on i've been going on inside of here even though so i think we found an entrance let's pick this entrance and go in the first door we cut down this place can lead up but let's see what's around us first before we start going up let's see around of us man So the backstory of this place now is that so many homeless people are residing inside of here. I can't blame them. I can't. <sighs> Bro. Who would have this place been? For you. I need to like be able to retrace my steps. So I don't just be going and be going. Yeah. But first, this is like the hallway. When you enter through, where I followed. Because for all of the details is leaving my head. Please just follow me on this not so detailed tour or two. So, they just came to my. This place should be a kitchen. Yeah, it should be a kitchen. Yeah, it looks like. And it's so dark. Let's see. What the? <laughs> this was the right thing I found so far here. Yeah. yeah, Bob, real cool. Let's go up and find more things. Yeah. So I'm climbing up to the first floor. I'm leaving the ground floor for now. Can you see? There's just a mole directly beside of here. Yes. Oh my god. Oh my god. Maybe I can take a thumbnail photo from here. <laughs> Let's see. So thumbnail done. But that, but that actually took a while. Let's get back. Let's get back, okay? What do you call this? Please tell me. No. I have no words. These are worlds. Worlds that has been. I don't know the adjective, bro. So this place is the banquet hall. Vamos. 
into the banquet hall. I welcome you guys to the banquet hall. Let's see what happens in the banquet hall. Chandeliers. These things are very, very expensive. I think they are falling off. So I better be careful here. The chandeliers are falling off. Oh my god, check out this art. Let's feel it, you just have to feel whenever you come inside this kind of place. Seems like ceramic towel. I'm not sure, I'm not trying to rip this one off, but this is just so beautiful to see. It is breathtaking. I can post for a picture here. So this is how the banquet all looks like now. And I grabbed some dust on my hands already. Like the views from like looking out of the windows from my hand of here is just just breathtaking, fascinating. Like and like on a day like this. I'm trying not to get people offended though. But the government, I don't know why you would have chose to sell this place. Yes, imagine this kind of place still runs. I bet it my neighborhood is still is looking very dry. So I'll not be going into all of this place. Let's get back. So I just came out of the banquet hall. I don't know what this place would have been. Just take a glimpse because there's still more to see. I'm trying to go up. Yeah, I'm trying to go up. Let's see the inside here. It's kind of dark. Let me put on the flash. Yes. As you can see, okay, better now. Oh my god, for you, I need someone to explain, someone that knows how this place is. It's like, explain to me where I'm working in everything because I can't bring the right explanation for you. For you. See, so we have gotten into from now. I just walked out of somewhere and it got inside somewhere. That is the most fascinating thing about here. Imagine this place is still bubbling and you can see that's real. Yeah. That was where I was coming from the other side. Inside of that bush. I was at the area. Look at look at the art on these walls, bro. Just enjoy it. I'm just inside an abandoned hotel. Yes, I'm just walking inside an abandoned hotel. That's what this video is. Look at this. Look at this beauty, for God's sake. Man. Man. I can imagine, like, maybe like the governor just walking through that place, going and his entourage are going behind him and all this kind of stuff going on here this is breathtaking i'm out of words i'm very sorry i don't know i don't have the right words to say about about here I mean, i'm just storing i swear i never want to leave a place that i got into but because i know that there's just too many of things to see here we keep it going <laughs> So this place is actually bigger than I thought it is. It's bigger than what you are seeing from the beginning, from the front. Right now, I'm still like, I'm like the second floor. I think that's one, two, three, four, five. Okay, you can get up to like the fifth floor. I'm sorry, you cannot imagine what I'm seeing ahead of me. These are rooms. Rooms.
What was happening here before? Just so you can know how deep. See, I've been coming from that place. Look at where I am right now. See where I still have to walk to to get to the end. Man, something just got in my slippers. My shoes. I have to figure that out. I'm excited to see. There's a light. Yes. Woo. This is, is food of lightning. That is something I love about it. And check out. I'm fascinated. So it seems to be the same thing. On the next floor. So I think. I either go up from here, then when I get up, or oh, let's just see. Let me show you guys. I tell you, this place is a very massive place. I can find people like farming inside of here. Let me see. That's like a farmer who came. And there's this lightning that just happened right now. found a couch here another couch there another so I'm kind of thinking this place were rooms yes there were rooms I think this was like they were demarcated with either these boards yeah maybe from here to like that place we all rooms but everything is destroyed bro look at what this is like you know what that is? Shit. Man, I can't imagine. So someone told me that why this place was destroyed was that the government after the government saw this place like the private Oh my god, I thought I'd be careful here. After the government saw this place up out like the private owner. Um, what happened was that Governor Binka Daddy actually sold this place. It was the governor at the time. Yeah. And maybe I think he sold it towards the time that he would leave office. Like close to the time he was going to leave leave the office. So after selling it, and like the private owners were very happy like to acquire this place. I think after he left office and that kind of stuff, the government came up and said, nah, this is a governmental place. Nobody has the right to sell it. Whether whether it's the governor or whatever, they don't have the right to like sell sell out the government that place. So they took the case to court and they started you know what's going to happen when you get to court. And I feel like the people that own this place, that bought this place privately, maybe they sent out people to like come and start destroying this place. Something of sort like after we spent our own money to buy this place. Now you're going to tell us we cannot own it. And the person that sold it has gone with the money he gets. So it's kind of like a retaliation. Why most of the properties here have been destroyed. Even though like you cannot abandon it somewhere for long and it won't be extorted or something like that. Or close to being destroyed. So I'm actually at somewhere now. Six. Exit to lift. So you wonder how this place is. The elevator is working. 24/7. For you, I don't know which way to like go on, on this. I think I'm going to do some like mini money more. But one thing I want to do is get to the top, top, top. I won't be surprised if I find someone here. Like, you can literally hide someone here. Nobody would know anything at all. And nobody knows I'm actually here. That's another thing that is scary. <laughs> I should start coming out. I should stop coming out here to lift. Let's see. That is six exit to lift. But this place is if you want to go to the lift. Okay. Something interesting to see here. So this is the elevator. 
Like, this is where the elevators were. One, two, three. Oh my god, I'm scared. And you can see I'm close to being at the top. Top floor. I think I have like one more floor to go. And I'm up. Just imagine. Imagine this place is running. Like you can find people of all classes inside here. Actually, it's equally the like rich people, like upper class people could even be able to afford this place. Just look at where I just got into right now, brother. Oh my god. Ah. I imagine I'm having a smoke up here. I'm tempted to right now. Oh my god. We'll just check out the beauty, bro. I don't know if all of this place is safe to walk. But let's see. Eee. <laughs> I just go into the pool of water. This is some crazy shit I'm doing. I'm sure someone will tell me I'm mad. But I'm, I've always been mad. Just check out what is here. Like. Oh my god. This is beauty. Look at bed. I would have fell inside this pool. I think I'll secretly, secretly come up here to like take pictures sometimes. Yeah, you can get like content ideas. Man, I'm going to film myself for a bit. Let me drop this camera. Yeah, Please just tell me what you think about this place. Do you think the government should open up this place back? Or they should sell it to a private owner? Maybe the person that had bought it before. Let him just go with his property. If he plans to like invest, invest in it here. I was at that place. That's where I started the video from. The PD right there, yeah. Just so you know how big this place is. All of this place. A very big land. I don't know the mathematics, so I'll just be telling you. How big it is. Check out this place. So I just walk in into this place that seemed like a suit. Imagine I got this room. It is very large windows. You know they are lightning coming in. There's still an AC on the wall. And check out this wardrobe. Check it out like a very large one for an hotel yes i see the massive bedroom and toilets and from you just need to look at the view from right beside of you you are taking a shit and just man man i'm still trying to get to the top top but I think I got there. I just walked out of that door. And this was where I was just now. And I'm at the top, top. I check out the neighborhood surrounding of this place. Wow. Wow. My camera cannot do this justice enough. But we'll see. Let me zoom out. So you can see. Just look at 
Jesus of this party. Check this out. So, I must confess, I love like the serenity, the peace, kind of peace that I found here. I love it. It's just cool. Look at the nature now. Everything is just. I just want to be wondering what kind of peace you are finding in this kind of place. But brother, this place is just cool. And the weather is like right. The weather is top notch. It's right there. Maybe if it's kind of sunny, I might not be enjoying it like I am right now. But I'm just enjoying the serenity. <laughs> that was this conviction I have to make. And we'll see what happens from here. Brother. not the best youtuber on earth or like the best vlogger to have worked so i hope somehow you guys enjoyed the tour of this place like this vlog in general i hope you guys find it interesting to see somehow how if you do really like it you know what to do give it a thumbs up like use the like button it's functioning so i know that you really like this video and if you'd like to you can subscribe to the channel that's not responsibility. But if you want to subscribe, you can subscribe. I really appreciate that. We're already coming to the end of this video. We are at the end already, sir. This is the end. Across, across the end. We're close to the end. Don't mess with me. So, this place is actually called Gateway Hotel. Gateway Hotel, yeah, that's what it's called. Even though it's big, abandoned hotel. It's called Gateway Hotel. And shout out to my friend. That gave me this idea to come and shoot in this place. It's been a long time. If you are watching this video, don't tell me you don't tell me. It's been a long, long time. But since then, I've had it in my mind to come and make this video. I'm very happy I did it today. Today is just the perfect time. Perfect. Maybe if it was very sunny, I won't be enjoying myself like this. It's just the perfect time for everything. And it's just what it is inside of here. Shout out to you, Ali. Thanks for the for the idea and the support and everything. Sham. Um, and bye bye to all of my viewers. Bye bye. Adios. Hasta luego. So now I just got down. Gracias por tu tiempo, amigo.